Hi there everybody, this is Christina and I am filming my very first video ever. Um, I belong to a group called Junk Journals Etc. on Facebook and I see a lot of people saying that they like little tiny envelopes or want to make them but they don't have the means to do it or they don't have the right tools but I actually got this idea from Little Hot Tamale on YouTube so this isn't my original idea. Um, you take a two inch piece of chipboard or cardstock or even a piece of paper and make your template and then you take a one and a half by one inch piece right here like this and then you cut out two inch squares of paper which I have right here and you'll have to excuse the mess in the background it's my dining room table um, I'm just kind of doing this on a whim so here's your two inch square you're gonna take this right here and then and you'll use this to cut them and then you're gonna stick sorry I'm out of frame here your one and a half inch piece right here then you're going to fold each corner over like that. And then you're going to glue these pieces down right here. Um, I don't suggest using double-sided tape for these because you will not have a lot of room to put it or even cut it down. Um, I'm not sure if you can see. Once you get it, it'll be a little tricky folding it at first, but once you get it down, you'll see how just a little bit of glue goes a long way here. Um, I have made several of these. Um, sorry, that's my son's inhaler in the background. My dining room table is a mess. I can't keep it clean. Um, I have a little pig pen slash Linus of an eight-year-old who I love very much. But anyway, these are all the envelopes that I've made. Um, I had a paper pad that I got from Walmart for like $3. So I... Um, I think I glued that one. Nope. Okay. And um, I made a whole bunch in like a span of one day. Um, Megan from Little Hot Tamale does a series called Build Your Stash. Some of these come out just a little uneven. It just depends on how you fold them. I keep the template here and the paper when I fold. That way... Um, I can get it just right. Sorry, I'm trying to hold the phone and do this because I don't have anything to stick my phone in to give myself free hands. I am an amateur and a rookie, so. Um, but I thought that I would make this real quick just to give some people an idea how to make little envelopes without having to purchase the Memory Keepers mini envelope board to make them. Um, I don't even think you can make these that tiny on there. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. Um, but yeah, this is just a little tiny envelope. I mean, you can see how little it is. They're not perfect, but I think they would do the job. Um, and as you can see, I have quite a few. So I'm looking forward to putting them in junk journals and hopefully sending some out in racks, RAKs, random acts of kindness, and maybe some trades with people for other supplies. So um, if you have any questions, let me know. I will link, try to link her um, YouTube channel. I think this one's a little uneven. It looks it. But I mean, for not having a memory keepers board, this isn't half bad. So um, let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up or thumbs down. But this is my first video ever. So um, if you give me a thumbs down, it's just the way it is. All right. Thank you for watching. And I hope this helps anybody that has been trying to make small envelopes or find a way to do it. See you all later. Happy crafting.